Greetings. Hey everyone, it's Goose. Do you know who this person is? Well, what if I told you this person is also this person? Yes, this is Megan Hall, the former police officer from Laverne, Tennessee. About a month ago, when the scandal broke, I posted a video of her on TikTok and YouTube. A new story came out yesterday. Megan has recently filed a lawsuit. To bring you up to speed, here is a clip of the first news story. Court documents, explicit and graphic detail of officers involved in sexual misconduct, some of it happening while on duty and on city property. Five have been fired. Patrol Officer Megan Hall, Patrol Officer Juan Lugo Perez, Sergeant Lewis Powell, Detective Seneca Shields, and Sergeant Henry Ty McGowan. Three others have been suspended, K-9 Officer Larry Holliday, Patrol Officer Patrick Magliocco, and Patrol Officer Gavin Schoberl. Police Chief Chip Davis issued a statement saying, in part, the actions of a few do not represent the entire department. The situation will be addressed internally and that counselors are being brought in to help officers. He also says there is sufficient staff remaining to cover all patrol shifts. So keep in mind, three of those officers were not supervisors. They did not have any rank, which means that Megan and them were on the same playing field. Now, one of them may have been a senior officer, which basically means if no supervisor is available, the senior officer gives guidance if needed. But that depends on the department's policy. Did you notice what the chief said? If not, play it back and listen to the statement from the chief. Here's a video that was released yesterday. Megan Hall was one of five officers, along with the Laverne Police Chief, fired last month for allegations of sexual misconduct on the job. But it was Hall, the only female, and just into her second year on the force, who became the face of the sexual scandal. These predators, starting from day one, worked to break down her psychological barriers and convince her to engage in sexual activity that she didn't want to. Attorney Wesley Clark, flanked by his client Hall, talked about the federal lawsuit they've filed naming the city of Laverne, former Sergeant Lewis Powell, former Sergeant Henry Ty McGowan, and former Police Chief Burrell Chip Davis. The lawsuit alleges the supervisors, quote, groomed Hall for sexual exploitation. Megan wasn't looked at like a rookie cop to be trained and promoted. She was looked at as a piece of meat to be sexualized and exploited. The lawsuit stems from a police department scandal involving sexual misconduct both on and away from the job involving officers. There are no criminal charges. There are going to be those who say these are consenting adults and she's trying to place the blame elsewhere. Well, yeah, it's really easy to think that whenever you don't understand the full story. Clark says Hall said no on several occasions, but her supervisors kept pushing until she gave in. Racked by depression to the point of considering suicide, the lawsuit says when Hall tried to end the sexual conduct, threats were made against her. That should be disgusting and outrageous to everyone who reads this case and understands the truth of what happened here. The city of Laverne declined to comment on the pending litigation. Now, after reviewing that video several times, could this be a case of he said, she said? I don't know. I don't know who to believe at this point. Now, when this story first came out, I did make a video. I did make a joke in the opening of that video. There was no ill intent intended in the joke that I made. It was not to make fun of anyone. I hope that we do find out what actually did happen. I don't think we ever will. We'll have a version of the truth, but as far as knowing what exactly was true and accurate, We'll never know. What's your thoughts on this? Comment and let us know.